Hello everybody. Well, I was in the midst of doing a water change and I bought this here yesterday, the JUP01 made by Sun Sun UV light. Well, after I bought it, today actually, I bought it yesterday, got it, put it in, it was in the tank for 24 hours, and I saw the video about this here, how it melts this and it leaches into the tank. Well, I came down today while I was doing my water change, took it out, put my finger inside, and guess what? Oh, it leaches in, it's all black and everything, so, it's another video where they tell you to take this and just get rid of it, but then they said that after you do that, well... Uh, the case basically melts then. So, what I'm doing, take a piece of inch and a half PVC. Okay. Whoops. Oh, I dropped it. Okay. Ugh. No cuts. This is live. Okay, now what you're going to do is take this piece here. Inch and a half fits right inside. Not bad, eh? So now what you want to do, get a square cut on one side as good as you can. Now right here, you see these little dots? You're going to cut below these, all below these dots. Then you're going to slide that up into here, and it's going to block these off. So after it blocks these off, what you're going to do is just come back and drill a hole in each one of these. So that way, you're making it for these holes. Okay? And then down here it has two holes here, two holes there, and I'm going to do the same thing. I'll either slot it or just put a couple holes in it. But that's basically what I'm going to do because this, pardon my French, is shit plastic. All we need is this here, then we'll block this off with the PVC here, which is going to just slide up inside of there. And then take my trusty acrylic glue, glue it in place, and that'll be that. Well, I got to do my water change, and then after I do that, I'm going to do some more of this video, and I'll let you see how it goes. All right, I'll see you in a little bit. All right, got this cut off, simply right off of that. Now, after you cut this, you're going to find out that this inch and a half is just a little bit too big to go in there. It's thicker down here for some reason than it is up here. Don't know why, but... What you're going to do, get your Dremel, get your um, barrel, sanding barrel bit, and just go around this a little bit right here, and then put it on the inside of that, and go around that a little bit, and that'll go right on top of that. It's just a hair small. I mean, it almost goes, I mean, I could force it on, but I don't want to, this is cheap plastic, and I know if I force it on, this is going to crack, so I'm going to run that out a little bit with the barrel wheel and I'll do this with a little bit with the barrel wheel and I'll glue it in and drill the holes and it should be good be back again all right after looking a little further you actually need to make the piece look like this cut it down put two little tabs on there because those holes are for the flow of the filter that's where the water gets sucked in. So when you put this on now, like so, give me a second. Okay. When you put that on, now the water can come through. So now that the water can come through, it'll work fine. Now I just got to put it together and glue it. Now I just got to glue it down and just square it off. If you can see right here where I took the drum, the sanding drum and sand it this down a little bit so that slides right on there like so and then it's on there and they keep it from going all the way up in I'll put a little bit of glue right there and that's it, it's done and then over here slider on, there you go well, that's it that's all you gotta do now. I'm not even gonna, maybe I'll put a hole here and a hole. A hole here and a hole on the other side. But other than that, I'll let it run for a couple of days and come back and let you know what's going on, how it worked, and that's it though. But that's it. That's the, that's what I came up with. So happy reefing, good luck, and later on, people.